Hi, I'm Shelly with Step Forward Fitness Training, and I'm going to tell you how you can lose 20 pounds. Yes, it's not that hard. You just have to follow through with the next few tips. The first tip to help you lose 20 pounds is to cut unnecessary sugars. Cut them out. Look at what you're eating. And if some of the sugars are very obvious, you already know that sugar, then you know to get rid of it. Some of them are just sugars you don't even realize you're eating. You need to become aware of where all you're getting your sugars. And that includes the drinks that you're drinking, the coffees that you're making, the energy drinks that you're drinking. All of those things add are unnecessary calories. And one thing about drinking calories is that your body doesn't tell you you're full of liquid calories. It'll tell you you're full when you've eaten a big meal. Oh, I'm full. But it's not gonna say, oh, I'm full of drinking. So stop drinking your calories. Okay, the next one is physical activity. Move your body. We all know we need to move our body. It's just doing it. But if you could apply yourself to 30 minutes a day, 30 minutes a day doing something, whether it's a walk, an exercise class, some weight lifting, just a little bit every day, you will burn some more calories and more calories. If you could burn with a, with a three mile walk, say you burn 250 calories, then if you could cut around 300 calories out of your diet, then you'll lose a pound a week. There you go. All right, the next one is plan on smaller portions. Use a smaller plate, put less food on your plate. Fill it up with the green stuff, fill it up with fruit. Don't load it down with processed, high calorie carbohydrates. Eat healthy, it's that simple. Do it on your plate, it's easy. The next one is journal. Journaling is no fun, but I have my clients begin with a journal all the time because it helps them to realize what they're eating, how much they're eating, how often they're eating, and it helps you to realize and to focus on where your changes need to be. You don't have to journal forever, but it helps you get a, a head start, and then if you kind of waver, it helps you to get back on track. So those right there, go back through those tips and practice those, and then before long, 20 weeks, 20 pounds. Have a great day.